Welcome back to Factorio Make a Page in a Book. My name is Ninaus and this is the episode 50 of our Let's Play. So, woo, celebration. And we're still barely maintaining 6060 updates as uh, even on a zoomed out view. So I'm pretty happy about that with the whole base churning. So first of all, I think I owe some of you an apology. Some of you an apology, maybe, maybe only some of you, uh, about my missing episode on Sunday. I know a lot of people are uh, interested in, which is super positive. It's always positive when, when people go like, yay, where is it? Or, well, actually not like yay, but more like angry pitchforks and, uh, and demanding uh, torches. Where is my Factorio episode? So uh, I'll take it as a compliment that you are uh, enjoying the show and uh, want to continue. So that is excellent. And thanks to the patrons, we are continuing. So let's uh, have a rework on what uh, what we're doing here. And it was not, it's not like I'm canceling or anything. Don't, don't you worry, don't you worry. We built this one last time, a monstrous amount of explosives but these explosives are not being demanded by anything they're not being used by anything so that is what we're going to do we're going to build at this location we are going to build uh, some artillery shell production and some rocket uh, production you could say that well is it really necessary we probably have enough here anyway well, we probably do but on the other hand we uh, we if you're playing in a, on a death world mega base then maybe you'd want this and this is based in a book so i'm also doing some stuff for uranium that we didn't technically need so let me request some things here i want a few more mm, where, uh, where where are the robo ports uh if you see the robo ports just go up there and then there we go thank you 20 of those i think that's going to be fine and then i will be demanding some robots as well because we're going to be doing a robot build so let's uh have 500 in hand uh, should be able to keep 500 in hand there we go that's not even, that's 400, that's 500. Can I do 500 more? I'll try it. Can we? It's gonna be close. Then we might need to ditch something else. Yeah, we could, perfect. That's great. Remove this and let's head out. So we are going to build, find our builder train. That somehow is gone. Okay, well, you're gonna come back here and then we're gonna be taking that train and hitching a ride to this, this location. As we are driving towards our location, I just got a uh, an idea, maybe more of a reminder. Here we are exploring and expanding and we are keeping expanding here. So it's time to build that perimeter. I know that it, this perimeter actually should be moved two down, but I can't really be bothered with that. So we're gonna be building the perimeter and then we're gonna see how uh, things are going to work. So I'm gonna build this here. And then I am going to get my robots down here to actually build it. And then I'll also build that here. And then let's see, how do we go up? We go up to that one. And here comes a tricky thing. Because is it possible to do this? Oh, it is. It absolutely is. All right. But there are some problems here with the signals. So I'm going to do something fancy. I'm going to do that one. I'm going to do that one. So I can alternate the signals by doing this and change it. So basically when they come here, uh, that's not going to be a normal signal. That's not going to be a normal signal. And this is okay. This one is definitely not a normal signal. This is not a normal signal. And on this side, we are also going to have some, this is not going to be a normal signal and neither is that. What about here? That's okay. So that's actually, I think that actually works. That's pretty cool. Let's let's try it though. And uh, let's see, you are coming in there. Uh, let's just make sure that we get the whole thing and then go over there. Cool. I have now reached my destination and it is time for us to do some design work. We are going to start with the design, obviously, and uh, then work from there. So let's see, we did in the previous episode, we uh, did some calculations about what we wanted to build. Uh, we do need some Okay, so we are going to build this and this and shells and these shells and uh, also there. So let's summarize what we need for this. We need iron and electronic circuits. That's the two things we need here. So that's already good. Then on top of that, we don't need any more. Uh, we don't need explosives. Yeah, so that's three things. And then we steal that. That's five things inbound. And that's it. Five things inbound. That means we are going to need a big location here. 
That should be very much doable. Let's see. Let Where do we have a location with five? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, it's beautiful. And there's not, not going to be anything inbound either. So we'll just take this one. Take it and build it here. Right? It does feel kind of wrong somehow. That's good. And definitely this one is not happening because it's not going to be an output signal here. And it's really important that it doesn't open up. And let's see, this is actually all pretty good. So let's build this on here as well. Oh, uh, that one is wrong. And we can try again. I like it. All right, so that's already kind of done. And this fits right in there, I guess. It does kind of right, fit right in there. And then we need to get those signals to be something different. Well, what are we going to do? We are going to take this will be... Well, I guess if this is iron already, let us take that as iron. And let's take this as... Hmm. Well, let's take this as green circuits then. There. Yeah, so that's comes in green circuits. Then what is the next thing we get in? That's going to be the... Oh, okay. Well, then we had green circuits there. Okay, well, you know what? Then I'm just going to be changing this one back to something else. That's going to be... Oh, something that doesn't exist. That's going to be the explosive one. Here. E as an end. And this will be red. We're not going to have red here. We are going to have... Oh, you're certainly not going to have red in that cluster. We are going to... It uh, doesn't matter. We'll select... We'll have plastic. Sure. And we will have steel. Further down. There. That's all the items we want. And then we'll figure out sort of the scaling of it. Uh, this scaling is definitely overdone. I need one belt of steel. I think... Well, actually, let's just take a look at the numbers for us. Okay, these are good. Kind of. Numbers. Here. That... And if we remember from last time, we said I wanted this one, but 64 of those pairs, that's going to be 10. So 10 plus 20 plus 30. Okay. And the other part will be here. Oh, this is, this is something is happening for sure. Oh, it's shooting. Perfect. It's all right. So it works. It works. It is getting in there. Nice. All right. And um, you will be patching up this area. This is uh, blued out. So that means it is actually there's a train coming this way. That's brilliant. And we have now lots and lots of shots coming in. Our roboport area is now a bit bigger, reaching a bit more. And unfortunately, the corner is not covered at all, which is uh, definitely not a good thing and also definitely not supportable. I can I do that? And I can also do this one. But one of them have to... Yeah. Let's see if... And... Okay, let me just go out again. Oh, I thought you didn't have Roboforce. Oh, I didn't have that. See, for some reason, repairs are just not super eager to go out. Is this better? It's better. Definitely don't want these mergers to merge together. So one of them has to be the lead. I think this one will be the lead then. Right, so go in and go out again because I think this one's going to be more busy for now on. And ooh, we have burned through all of our repair packs. Really? Really? No robots. No robots. Okay, now the robots are coming in. That was odd. But it's working. It's working. Great. And over here as well. Damn, I love this pattern. I love it. It's so good. But anyway, that's not what we're doing. We are going to make... Uh, how many do we need? Like eight of those? It's on an eight second cycle. 15 second cycle. Okay, well that's 15 then. Is that 15? Come on. There, copy. Uh, 15, yes. So we need this one on a 16 second cycle, but also on a double 16 second cycle, right? There, yeah, it's at ratio, and this is not enough. This, oops, this one here has to be multiplied by four. 
eight. And I get, no, that's, that's not correct. That's not correct, I'm sure. <laughs> and no, 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 it was, it was two. There we go, this one, like two and a half, and that's 20 steel. Yeah, that's, that's more doable. And yeah, so that's ratio we did so that we know. Let's get started by getting some beacons because everything is going to be modulated and beaconed as heavily as we can. Let's get that one. And get more. And get some power lights. This is not even enough. All right, so the first thing we are going to do is going to be the, well, I guess the simplest one. Okay, you're going to go out and you're going to go out. So hopefully this is enough. Let's start with here. These are at a one to one ratio. So let's just see how many we can build of this. And there. All that getting done. And now we can see how much we got. This has to be 10. So what if we do here? Eight. Mm -hmm. Not quite there yet. Two down, two down, a lot more down, so we can get as much as possible, and and then again, check the ratio, 9.8, and let's, what are we doing, something like this, 10.7, then we can kill these two, that's slightly more than 10, so that's good. I will take this and then it's going to be super simple because we're just going to do it the same on the other side and this will just be change the recipe for that because they're on a one to one cycle so that's easy now could we should do belts in or should we not do belts in? not yet I think I'm sure we can deal with the belts it, let's continue on the next one to see how that's going to work Oh, we're already running out of that. Okay, let's uh, let's replenish as well as uh, take this build a bit here. We're gonna have to build it, and but make absolutely sure we do not actually get it in here. And what about down in this corner? This looks glorious, and that covers the corner, so I can start going out here and then uh, stamp some more blueprints in. Uh, this is now actually kind of a blueprint, isn't it? Because that's the one we have to build for these intersections, and then. Yeah. All right. So you go there, and then you go there, and then you go whoosh, 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 whoosh. There. Sweet. Are you out of resources here? Definitely all of that, and all of that. Maybe a few more. Uh, what else are we missing? Definitely always that. Uh, there. There you go. Filled up. That is to be expected. We'll clean this one up once we know how much we need of each belt, of each input, but at least we have the right names for this. And we're building it here. All right, so this will be the shells. Here. Good, let's start on this one. I need 10 of these shells as well. Okay, well that, that, what? All right, good, good stuff, good stuff. We'll we'll do that. <laughs> I guess that's simple. And then uh, we'll build something on the other side. I don't need very much, so maybe we just do, I don't know, like this. Oops. And change this to the actual artillery shells. And I need two and a half of this. Two point something. Two and a half. Oh, perfect two and a half. And it takes ten of these. So we now have the ratios. Then we just need some... How much do we need? In order for us to do this, I need 2.5 radars. Isn't that exactly what we built with this? It's exactly what we do. So we need to get 25 here plus 12 and a half. That might not be as simple as it looks. So I think we're going to have to do something along the lines of... Nope, not you. I don't know, maybe something like this and get gears and then fully module these. 
how much we got. 16. That's definitely enough. That's definitely enough. It it might even be too much. Uh, so I, I could scoot it up here if I want to. And then I'm going to have uh, this friend here in that location. Because even if it did not apply to any beacons, then it should work. So um, I'm going to get a line of iron coming in here. And that is going to be split on this side. Because I am going to need this much inbound. To keep this flowing, I need 12 inbound. And that's slightly more than a mod uh, one of these can take. So we're going to need this. And then on the other side, I'm going to do that one. This will also need 25. So oof, that is a problem, I think. I think that might actually be a bigger problem than, than uh, it looks. I think I have to do this to get that sorted. Yeah. And then I need some outbound. I can do that. I have a plan. So I'm going to get this one here. This one will go sort of up here and around and then in there. Yeah. So what if we do this? That goes out on the bottom side and it goes in on the inside. This is going on. Well, I don't know. Inside from this perspective on the right hand side is the shells and on the left hand side we will get the radars in and that's ready for pickup there perfect good stuff and we still need the inbound why can just do that how much do we need inbound for oh 12 and a half that's kind of kind of a lot isn't it kind of a lot so let's take that on the outside because i kind of need more than two for this there and then on this belt I can get the double row of of explosives. 20, yeah. So let's just do a double row of this. And I'm also going to need, need an inbound as well, or an outbound as well. So this is picking up two different things. This I'll do that one. Okay, we're actually starting to do belt stuff here because this one is kind of quirky. So inbound, in, inbound, outbound, outbound. And these funnel in here and go out. So this is working. And we are needing some kind of some kind of thing here. We'll just put it here. All right, this is also good. Let's see. Now that it's powered, let's see if we got the ratios right. 15 so we have enough gears to go in here. Yes. We are producing exactly 2.5 that's exactly what we're needing. That means it has to be produced in everything or, or all the time. And we are getting here 20. Well, we don't know where that, this is 46. This is more than one belt. However, it should not be a problem because this is overproducing. If we count backwards from this one, this is 2.5. So I need 12 and a half gears and each gear is, well, obviously two. So let's do a calculation here. And I'm going to do 12.5.5. I'm going to need two of those for each. Oh, I saw the other way around. I'm going to need two gears for each. That was without any productivity. And then I'm going to divide by 1.4. That's 17.86 gears or iron needed for gears plus the 25 needed. That's still 42.86. So it's less than one belt. And it's beautiful. It's absolutely beautiful. Perfect. Love it. And this is then now our output going all the way down there. And then I'll go into something. Oh, man, sometimes sometimes these just fit together so nicely. That's good. This is a nice, beautiful build. That's going to be green circuits. This is going to be lots of explosives. This will be iron part. I can actually do it there. That's going to be nicer as well. Good. And then let's do the same thing for these. Actually, I should be so where I can kind of remember this. Yeah. Explosive. Yes. And that was incorrect. It was not explosive. So that's probably why I should be doing this. And this is Anfa. There we go. And over on this side, what do we have? We have three things inbound and they're all at equal ratio. So I think that I'll take a full line in here that's shared 
So let's just go up here. That one will be shared between, I don't know, let's call it that one and that one. And then I am also going to take another line in here, which will be a half line. And we'll do this, this pattern here again. Except this time, we're going to shift this upwards. And that jumps under. That's good. And this will now need to go to here. Damn, I'm really liking the speed by which we're building here. I think this is a better spot. Because I'd like to have them here, just here. Yeah. Oh, it's like it's like this almost room. What is this one for? That's not for anything. What if I did that one? Then I could put it in here. Uh, and there would be a little gap. But that gap can be alleviated by doing this. Or I could also just have done it properly. Yeah. There we go. Perfect. Much nicer. Damn, this is a nice build. This is really nice. And it's progressing at a really decent speed, I think. So that goes under. And that goes under. This is now done. And we have it in here. All right. Next up. This is almost certainly going to be the same location now. Go here. And we might as well build it over on this side as well. Are they connected? They're still connected. Sweet. All right. Um, let's do here. This will be... And yeah, we get an iron line in. So let's get an iron line in on this part. That should be easy. And then we get the shared line again. We're going to do this build here. Oops. And that will go... Oops, come on. Up and in... And hopefully do something like this. What do we need here? We need just explosives. But it's not actually a lot of explosives, is it? Eh, 21. I don't know. We, yeah, but it, it should be fine, right? I can do that. Explosives. Here. That one. And coming in. Should work. And then this will just be a very simple output down to here. All right. And you know what? I'll build it on this side. And input and input and input. Let's remember to actually put some lights in here. Okay, we'll put lights and... Damn it, we'll put lights everywhere. Sure. Here. That goes into that one. And can it also go in here? It actually can. Huh. Sweet. And can I do the same thing on the other side? Uh, it's going to be different, but it'll still be fine. Yeah. Lights, lights, lights. Good. Hey, we, we just built everything here. That is so cool. Uh, let's see if this is a good spot to have it. I think it is. <clears throat> Let's see, we are going to get two lines of iron in, one, two. So this has to be a, not a one, two, four splitter, but a one, two, two splitter. Okay. Which we have here. All ready and waiting. That's going to be the iron part. And let's flip the right way. And that will be going down there. And going down there. That's one. Then the next one is, okay, that will be actually three different locations it comes in. One, two, three. And this one is a double, but these two are half. So I think I'll do this one. And then I will do this belt over here is going to go straight in. 
I assume. Well, let's not assume anything too much because we're going to get the green ones as well. So that's going to go in here. And this is going to go into some kind of mix here between these two. No, actually not. It's just going to go half in here and the other half in there. And let me just confirm. This one requires... Uh, what? Oh, oh my god, I'm, I'm panicking. I thought I like, made a massive mistake. I did kind of make a massive mistake by doing this, but copy-paste. Uh, let's do this again. 21. And this one is consuming 21. And this one's consuming 10. 10 plus 21 plus 21 plus... That's no good. Uh, let's see. This here is going to be there. And what was the other one? Explosives. Yeah. All right. So actually, at this point, I think I'm going to get a much a bigger one here. It's going to be a one to four. Wherever do we have those one to fours? We have them everywhere, right? Except where I need them. Now it's, everything is a 1 to 2. I can never find it. Yeah, there we go. That's the one. Except the station. It's just a beautiful room for that. And. Kind of wondering if I'm using too much space for this. Who cares? That goes in. It doesn't matter which one's where. Ah, the explosives. What is going on? It's not so bad. Right? It's not so bad. It's, it's working. And that's kind of the intention. To explode more things. Sweet. I like it. Let's get you sort of reinforcements ready. And let's build another one of these. I love that we can do the expansion at the same time. And... You, 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 you. Then I definitely can't do more than this. Maybe. Where are we going? This is going... So it's going to be one, two, and three, and four. Yes. Good. Next one will be... What? Plastic? Okay, plastic is definitely going to be a single. So let's get the single from here. Plastic. Single line. Oops. Here. Next one is... That's the plastic going up there. And this is the steel going here. Uh, plastic... Hold on. Plastic and steel are only going in there. So plastic and steel can actually just do a separate trick here. They can just do that. And then go straight in. That's the only place I'm going to need it. Sweet. And then the next one, will, or the last one. No, the last one here will be... Mm, is that iron? Yeah. I'm going to need two full belts of iron, right? What? That's the iron part. What is the last part we're missing? Ah, green circuits. Green circuits. Yeah, 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 yeah. Green circuits. What? Come on, look at those. Yeah, yeah, that's going to be greens. I we, we, What are they called? Green circuits? There. Circuit. Electronic circuits. And that's going to be a one. It's really not a lot. Is it? Actually, you know what? Let's make it a two or two, two. Because there's two sources that are needing it. And I can just see that we forgot. That. Just making it easier. And. That's one. We still get lots of... Oh, yellow. Yellow science is, is running out. Yellow science is running out. I'm going to get some more here. And also build this. Yellow science. Ah, well, at least we have something we need to look at next time for sure. Let's get some more belts. It's going to be a lot of belts here. Good. Anything else running out? No, not really. I think we're good. 
And I'm rushing as much as I can here so we can get all of this. Well, not rushing it, but you know, just trying to get things to work in order that one. And something to this effect. Good. And the other one is just a plain inbound here. So we take the lower ones first. It's always the best to take the lower ones. And then I'm going to jump to that location. If I can. No, I'm not. I'm going to go. If this, this is the right location. Okay, next one. This is... Two here. And next one. Two here. And the last one. And we need the iron parts. Ah, uh, what? Damn it. This is missed. I missed it. Too close. And then these, all the rest of this is also too close, right? One down. Yep. Here. And the top one. And up here. I'm kind of wondering this this doesn't look right. I think that's if it was a more rigorous grid, then I would build it like this. Yes. Alright, I think we're all good, except for all of these uh, small things that need to be changed. <laughs> I think we're good, except for all the things we're missing. Yeah, that's pretty much always the case. And that goes in. That goes in, coming from here. And I'm also going to get... Just want to make sure that we got this. All right, this will be changed to green. And I also need to make sure that that goes into the network. That's the green one. And this will have values as greens. That is one, 144. And I'm kind of sort of regretting this. 3270. What? Okay, hold on. Where do we have something that requests green circuits? Uh, this is getting confusing for me there. This is requesting green circuits. Where are you? You are that one. What are we at? There. 144. 64. Of course it's 64. 32, 64. And yeah, so this is good. This one is the steel. So we're going to change this to steel. We're going to change this to... That looks okay, right? 16. Yep. 36, 16. Yep. That's good. And this will be plastic. Plastic here. Yep. And that will be the same numbers as there. Here we're going to get explosives. That will be explosives on this line. And that will be half as much. So this will not be 72. It will be 36. And then 16 in a train. Two, four, yeah, 16 in a train. What did I get here? Still not correct. This is still not correct. Damn it. Let me see if the top one. Top one should be correct. Yes. And the iron. Good. So this is. Green circuits. Double. Steel. 32 in the train. Plastic. 32 in the train. Explosives. 16 in the train. And that one, 72. There, 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 there. And I'm checking they're connected, 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 connected. I have a tendency to forget these things. So uh, that's, oh, and do I want to produce before I do anything else? Yeah, let's do that. Let's let's get everything in here and just see it. Uh, what about uh, Roboport Network? Yep, Roboport Network coverage is good. 
And it is time for us to build that one. And then just uh, slide in here discreetly. And then we should see lots of stuff coming in. And I can then build the last bits. That is the storage of all of this. Which should be pretty straightforward, I guess. Yeah. Alright. I'm going to get a lot of storage for this. How much storage? How much do I have in each one of these? Actually, I think it's better for me to have this being stored because if I am about to deliver some one of these into the robot port and I just set the robot ports out, then they will need to come back. And that's just easier if I do it this way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And one is, there's 200 in each. Yeah, this might be a bit much. Let's do five. Five plus five, that is, so that's 10 times how much I can have in one storage box. One storage box can have 2,000? That's 9,600. So it's about 100,000 rockets. That sounds about right. I mean, yeah, it sounds about right. And over here, this might be even better, even more. This is only 48. So 48 times 10 is 480. That's not a whole lot, is it? Hold on. We're having a problem. We're having another little problem that I didn't even foresee. Oops. Uh, I was counting on this getting in on a robo port, and I don't think that's how I wanted it to do. So you're going to go to one train explosive, that one, and then you're going to empty. Huh. Ah, that's, now that's kind of iffy, isn't it? Because obviously I'm going to get this one out here, but... I think I have to build another train station here. The sixth one. The magical sixth one. There. And also definitely one here. So this will be something with artillery shells. That one, I guess. But that's not a good number. That's not a good one. That's not a good name. Uh, let's see. It, it is the name it should have. That I just called reload here. I I can sort of I can sort of figure out if there's something gonna be something else here. Uh, this will be a train station, obviously, which will have one, two, three, four wagons, and it'll basically be the same as this one up here. Uh, let's see, this is on top, but I could clip it. What? A rail blueprint. It's a rail blueprint because of that. Right, so here's the kicker. That's not going to be there. That's going to be fine. And inbound. So let's see if we can get a train in here. So this one will... Uh, this one will be overlapping here. Uh, the, when will I open this? I'll open this when I have in this storage. I have 10 in each. So this is... 60, no. 60, 240. So when... There. When this one is... Equal to or greater. Oh, that's not it. <laughs> there. Where's the evaluator? There. Company it. This is greater than or equal to 240. It can only ever be 240, but... Then output one... L. 
good. And then I'm going to get a little light up here. That will also be lighting up with an L. Eh, L. This is set train limits to L. Perfect. Eh, kind of perfect. And then I can get it up here on the green wire. I'm going to do that one. This one will be... If L is times one, I'll just put as explosives. Yeah. That's how much is provided to the network. Good. It looks like things are actually working. Oh, cool. Is it working? No, it's not working. Oh my God. The most basic of basic things. An output belt. And the output belt on this line is 10. So not a problem getting it outbound. This is going to work. This is going to work. And then the, this is why I bought some extra, extra things here. And then I'm going to put all of these in here. And then I am going to wonder why this is not working. I think I know why. I need to connect the two networks. And then it goes in here. Then let's see. That one is lighting up because there is now 240. This means this is available. And now I just need to figure out a train schedule for this, but I'm not really sure I'm going to do that right now. That's probably something we can come up with in the next episode to figure out a good way to schedule this. We've also been expanding out here. Look at how clear this southern front frontier is. That is wonderful. And we have made a really cool design, I think. Uh, what I'm going to do here is take that one over. Uh, and this will now be the refueling point for, for this. So we are going to get the trains... The, yeah, we're going to get the, what are they called? The rope spider trons in here. And uh, that will be where they will be replenishing. It would be cool if I sort of had display here of how much I have. That would be like really cool, like a digital display. So I could just look at this and go, okay, I have 2,324. Huh, that would be cool. Maybe we want to do that. Now, wouldn't that be fun, like doing a digital display so that I can just look at this and then see over here how much artillery I have and how much. Yeah, that would be cool. Anyway, that's definitely not going to be in this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you uh, like this really, really cool uh, design. I, I'm really happy about it, specifically, particularly this part, how well it performs. We're just going to be looking at it just to make sure that everything is flowing. It looks really nice. Like the whole thing is just churning and burning through a lot of resources as well. But, you know, it is all in the name of, uh, of defense. And by defense, I mean the, the genocide of biters. But, you know, it's all semantics. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this uh, design session. What I'm going to do next time is uh, probably take a look at the train schedules and uh, uh, just also more expansion and figure out if things are not working. And then we'll be transitioning into the doubling of the whole damn thing. That's going to be exciting. So thank you very much for watching. Be sure to hit the like button so I know that you are still watching and available and uh, enjoy it. I'll see you guys next time. Take care and stay effective.